Ford is taking its foot off the gas, delaying plans to produce electric vehicles out of its Oakville, Ontario plant by two years. Ford says the extra time will allow for EV demand to pick up. The union representing workers is pushing back. Promises have been made and we expect Ford Motor Company to live up to that. One of those promises, secure jobs, about 3,000 of them. Ford now says there will be layoffs. It's just uh, deeply uh, disappointing. Sharing in that disappointment, the province and the federal government. They each invested $295 million in the Oakville plant. Both say they plan to press Ford. Obviously, this is not the news we expected. Uh, we wanted that time frame to be as short as possible, and that's what we're going to push the company for. Despite the investment and the anger, some experts are defending the new timeline, saying growth in EV sales is slowing, in part because of the cost and concern over battery range. Automakers don't control the consumer. We have to build out the supports to help more consumers make that switch and make the jump into electric. Others note that Ford is not alone. General Motors is also slowing work to retool factories for EV production. And Tesla has seen a large dip in sales. Both signs that not everyone sold on the switch to electric yet. We all do know where this is headed. It's the only debate we're having is uh, how steep the curve is. Still, Ford is aiming to roll out its seven-seat EV at the Centario plant by 2027. And with Canada aiming to end the sale of new gas-powered cars in 2035, a shift is imminent, even if the pace is now slowing. Philip Lee Shannock, CBC News, Toronto.